Cubie. And I'm Cubette. Welcome to our cooking club, where kids learn to cook. It's tasty. Made it simple. Sarah, Mom said everyone would be here in 30 minutes for the cookout. Are you sure we'll have enough time for all this? That's why these homemade pretzel bites are perfect. They taste best right out of the oven. Well, come on. Sarah, preheat the oven to 450. Sure thing. So one cup of lukewarm water, four tablespoons of melted butter, and one packet of yeast has dissolved, and it's been five minutes. Now we need to add in the two teaspoons of salt and two tablespoons of brown sugar. This needs to mix with the three cups of flour for five minutes with the dough hook. Looks like it's really sticking to the bowl. Just add a quarter cup of flour and it will stop sticking. Once we have eight pieces, we will roll each piece into a long rope. Wow, these are really long. Yeah. Now the fun part, just pull and cut. Am I doing this right? Just keep each piece to around two inches. So once I brush the top of these with egg wash, you sprinkle. Got it. You know, you can add any seasonings you want, like garlic salt or Italian. You read on the cinnamon, Mom. Careful putting them in. Once that's done, we change the heat to broil and brown the tops two to four minutes until they're just right. You need to stay close to the oven because they can easily burn here. Good timing. Everyone's almost here. Let's set out some bowls with different dipping sauces like chocolate and caramel. We can change this cookout into a dipping party. Looks like any topping would taste great on those pretzels. You can check out other options online. For this recipe and more, visit imperialsugar.com or dixiecrystals.com. And thanks for watching.